Hey guys, Doward out here in the workshop. I've got a Turnigy 2100KV 1 8 scale uh, motor here and I want to know what makes it tick. So I'm going to pull this guy out. I love the color. It's got a nice gunmetal color to it. Got Wires are stiff, very stiff wires. 5 millimeter bore. Uses a five millimeter pinion. And let's open her up. Fell off first. Five twenty nine bearing. Interesting. Oh, that was actually not a screw. That was actually the back end of this guy. See, we've got these two spacers. The bigger one goes on the short side. I have two spacers over here with what appears to be an O-ring that it rides against. Let's see what the dimensions of the rotor are. <laughs> Let go. All right. We have an overall 35.67 millimeter by. 20 millimeter. Ah. So it's got a much smaller rotor than the 10 shock that I looked at previously. Which makes me think the 10 shock should have a good bit more power to it. But the overall length of the case and all also appears to be slightly smaller. And the bearing down in there, actually once you knock this out would be very easy to get out. You can actually, once you take this guy out, the bearing, you're looking at it right there on the back end so I really didn't even need to remove this plate in order to take that bearing out so I'm not even going to bother to take that plate out but here's what she looks like inside hopefully you can see this looks like some pretty cheap enamel over the wiring looks like it's pretty well run though it's well run just doesn't have any doesn't look like it's got any kind of nice enamel on there let me slide these all back on and we will begin reassembly I'm going to knock the back end off. <laughs> let, the, let her slam into it. So I wasn't going to take the back end off, but there, you can see what I mean about the, um, the enamel just pour. And of course the wires are directly from, from a stator. So please, whatever you do, don't cut those. Bearings in this are look to be double metal shielded. screws back in.
ten shock is definitely longer. Got sixty five millimeters by forty two. So a 4274 versus a 4265. 10 shock obviously comes with more wire on it. Same diameter. 2100 kV versus 1850 kV. There they are.